ahead on Daytime Buffalo. Wedding week continues with Brenda Bay Bridal here to show how their incomparable dresses with a one-of-a-kind design experience. And it's back, the Paddock Golf Dome is up and running. We'll show you everything they have going on and what's to come this season. It's all coming up right here on Daytime Buffalo. Hello and welcome to Daytime Buffalo. I'm your host, Chelsea Lavelle. Thank you so much for joining us as we continue to celebrate wedding week. Now yesterday, we touched on the sweeter side of wedding food and even looked into a popular venue in Hamburg, but today, it's all about saying yes to the dress. Part of the excitement of getting married is the moment when the bride-to-be says yes to the dress. Today, we have Brenda Pittner in to educate us on the Brenda Babe difference when saying yes to a dream dress. Tell me about your Brenda, Brenda Babe bridal shop. Hi. Hello, Chelsea. Thank you so much for having me today. I'm so excited to have you. You are a ball of energy. Uh, I try, I try. <laughs> no, I'm very excited that you're doing this wedding week. Um, saying yes to the dress, obviously. Um, it's, it's just so exciting for that bride to find the perfect dress. So having something unique with my shop is I do a lot of customization. I love to work with the bride individually to offer her that true one-on-one -on -one experience so that she doesn't have to just buy a cookie cutter dress. We seriously work one-on-one -on -one to find the perfect dress for everyone. So we're gonna run down all of the mm -hmm. frequently asked questions mm -hmm. for anyone that's getting married or knows mm -hmm. someone. The first question is when should the newly engaged yep. person start searching for that dress? Absolutely, if you can give yourself a year, give yourself a year. I know it sounds like a lot of time, but it goes by really fast. Wow. Um, the beauty is though, I work with a lot of independent designers. So obviously if you have to cut it short, your wedding is on a shorter timetable, I can accommodate that. But if you can give yourself a year, definitely, but most special order dresses in my shop will take anywhere from six to eight months upwards of a year. Wow, okay, mm -hmm. so for your shop, do people need an appointment? Yes, yes, I am by appointment only because of the unique nature of the appointment. So because I only work with one bride at a time to truly give her that experience, we definitely need appointments, but I offer all dates and times and I work around very busy schedules. So if there's a date and time that works for a bride, you just let me know and we make it work. Now, what is the price range for your shop and your dresses, especially because yep. obviously they're custom? Absolutely. So anything I can work with budgets averaging for special order dresses anywhere from about 1600 to 3500 but I also offer dresses off the rack, sample sales, things like that for a much lower budget if need be. And what about sizing? Mm -hmm. Sizing, definitely. I work with all body types, uh, sizes anywhere from zero to 30. I also offer custom sizing so that you don't have to purchase a dress based on one measurement. So right. a lot of times when you purchase a dress, it comes in, maybe you need a lot of alterations up top because mm -hmm. you have to order it based on one measurement. We can do custom size measurements so that it actually helps to alleviate a lot of extra alterations and custom lengths as well because not everyone is 5'7 to 5'10. Yeah. So we can <laughs> Not do everyone can have your height in those long legs. <laughs> we try, but we can accommodate that as well. So, because you want to, again, have the dress be reflective of of the individual. Now, do you do the alterations at Brenda Bay Bridal? I actually work with a talented team of alteration specialists across the area. Okay. So it works depending on where the brides are located. It makes it easy for them. So I refer and I have great partnerships with seamstresses around the area. Now you actually charge people to come in and mm -hmm. shop, just to shop, why is that? We don't say just to shop. <laughs> just to shop. Right, I know we hear that oh too, all too often and I do charge a consultation fee because basically at my shop, I don't like to say dress shopping. The experience is more about styling mm -hmm. and when we work one-on-one -on -one and we offer that time for the bride to discover what works for her, what works, 
what may not, uh, different silhouettes. So that time, which can take anywhere from an hour and a half to two and a half hours, believe it or not, mm -hmm. is reserved specifically for us to work together. So basically you're not coming in and paying a, a fee and say, okay, let me look around at dresses and let me, let me pull and try and for myself. No, you are getting a personal stylist mm -hmm. for your time with me. So that's where that and comes And it's, it's about the experience, the right? The experience, absolutely. Mm -hmm. Now, I want to know how exclusive your dress designers mm -hmm. are. I love that you asked that question. I, I am very happy to, and I handpick all the designers I work with for that reason, for their fabulous factor. Um, basically, what customizations they can offer my girls. Um, I, in fact, one of my designers is a sister duo out of New Zealand, and wow. I am only one of a handful of stores in the entire country that carries this designer. Um, they're very big in Australia, New Zealand, but um, I stalked them during COVID. I loved their vibe. I thought, oh my gosh, they're going to be perfect for my girls in the shop. And they were, and we hit it off immediately, and they do lots of different customizations. Uh, they love to work one-on-one, -on -one, just like I do with my girls. So it's, it's great to have those indie designers that maybe you won't find in a lot of the stores around here, but which also makes for a truly unique, one-of-a-kind dress as well. Well. And speaking of your girls, you brought one of your Brenda babes here. <laughs> Tell me about Gina Bro, because this is actually a completely custom dress. Yes, I love Gina. Hi, Gina. Gina Hi. just got married <laughs> last Congrats, fall. Congrats, Gina. Thank you. <laughs> and her dress was actually designed from a few different things. So if you look at the dresses on either side of her, um, the bodice of the one dress the skirt, the one you're looking at now, the skirt of that dress, and we added a slit. Gina, show us those amazing boots. We had to showcase those boots. We had to showcase boots. those boots. Yeah. So the we needed parts. a slit. <laughs> Gina is a very rustic chic bride. She really <laughs> wanted that to come through in her dress. And we, if you notice, her dress is also an almond color too to match that great jacket. And so we actually did that to the dress as well. We, It's an almond colored lining based on on combining those two dresses in her custom sizing and adding the slit as well to make this beautiful look and this is just this is all Gina and what <laughs> Show I was the top Gina because that was big oh yeah there we one, go right yeah yep That's so you can beautiful. see the bodice of that and wow. I always tell my girls, the, you can buy a beautiful <laughs> dress anywhere. Obviously, there are lots of beautiful boutiques. But the magic happens is when you can put this dress on and walk down the aisle and they say, oh, that is such a Gina dress or that is such a you dress. <laughs> no one else has a dress No like one that. else no has one. one. <laughs> now, Gina, I want to know about your experience coming into Brenda Bay Bridal and making this custom dress. So I didn't know what to expect. Um, my mom and I and our family went and I was so excited. And when we got there, Brenda just was so happy and excited to help us. And she just totally put this dress together for me. Everything that I told her that I liked and didn't like, she took everything and just put it, it exactly into this dress. And it's exactly what I wanted. So it worked out great. Well, that's awesome. <laughs> Congratulations Thank again you. to you. That's an amazing dress. Tell us where we can find your shop and get more information to come yes, see you. Yes, I am in West Seneca, 1021 Union Road. I'm directly across the street from the Southgate Plaza and there is a big old white sparkly bow on the front of the building so you can't, you can't miss, miss me. You can't miss it. You can't miss me. Um, and you can go to my website at brendabaybridal.com um, and I've got lots of information there. You can book an appointment to see me right from the the website but there's lots of fun stuff there and um, yeah and I'm just I would love to welcome more of you beautiful Brenda B brides there all you go here. that right there is what you're seeing is her website you can go on there make an appointment to get the dress of your dreams thank you for coming on thank and making you. that dream dress come true for so many brides thank you so much for having we me. love having you come back anytime I will Coming up after the break, today is National Cereal Day, and here in the 716, one local business has you covered no matter where you go. Pull up a bowl and join us as we pour over the cereal spot. And after taking damage from the big winter storms, a popular recreational facility is back. Hereby, they say they are better than ever. That's coming up after the break. <laughs> 